Hello everybody, this is Dr. Kevin Novak. I thought I'd do a quick video. I did some video on some aquarium lightings and I try to explain that instead of buying a Kessel light that you could buy these light bulbs right from any hardware store and you can actually modify them and make an aquarium light. <coughs> and the thing about it is that uh, I was just in Myers and when I was there at Myers uh, I found a real nice pendant that someone could put over their fish tank and use it instead of the industrial looking ones that you buy that are made for reptiles. Anyhow, uh, like I said in my last video, is that with aquarium lighting getting so cheap, look at this 150 watt bulb here. It puts out uh, 5000K at 2200 luminous. And as you see over this antique tank, I have two lights. This tank is 27 inches, so if you have a 27 inch tank, you're going to need two lights. And of course, this is the industrial light you buy, and this is for um, reptiles. But when I was at Myers, I found this pendant. Look at that, that's a nice pendant that you could put over your aquarium instead of buying those industrial ones. And if you think about it, you can put different uh, light bulbs in it depending on your aquarium if you had a small aquarium you would put a 60 watt in if you had a, a larger aquarium let's say a four foot aquarium you could use like four of these and you could put a 150 watt at 2200 lux which would be more than enough for a four, four foot tank a three foot tank you would use two of these but if if you think about it this light pen in here only costs 40 bucks so that means, let's say you had a 30-inch tank and you bought two of these, and then you bought the brackets to hold it. You can put any kind of light bulb in there uh, that you wanted to, and as bright as you wanted to. And then in the future, if you got a bigger tank or whatever, you, you can change the light bulb to a higher wattage light bulb. But look at how nice this pendant is over your fish tank. And it still would cost less than a Kessel light. And yet you can modify it by putting different light bulbs inside a pendant like this and put it over a tank and it won't look so industrial looking. I mean, when I was there, I was tempted to buy, I was going to buy two of them to put over my antique tank, but they only had one. So next week I ran out of time. Next week I'm going to go and I'm going to buy two of these to add them over my antique fish tank instead of the black ones that look so industrial looking. So when you do lighting there's no reason you have to go out and buy an expensive kessel look at how nice that fixture is and that could be hanging over your fish tank it'll look real sharp it, it will uh, show off the tank especially if your tank is in a place where there's uh, people can view it and for the price and you figure two of these would cost you 80 bucks and the light bulbs let's say another 30 so what you got $110 and you got two light fixtures you can put over a 30 gallon tank at uh, 220 luminous a piece and it'll look super sharp how can you beat that so I just want to make a quick video to let everybody know that uh, thinking out of the box a little bit uh, can get you some real real super sharp light fixtures over your aquarium and this light was at Myers. so until next time uh, this is Dr. Kevin Novak Bye-bye.